My name is Melissa Beneshai, and this is how I reinvented myself. I'm President and Chief Product Officer at Baked by Melissa. When I graduated from college, I knew that I wanted to live in Manhattan, and I knew I needed to get a job in order to do that. So I got the first job I could find at a media sales agency. I made great friends, and one of my colleagues there, I made him red, white, and blue, Grateful Dead themed tie-dye cupcakes. And the response I received in that office when I brought them in for his birthday was unbelievable. So I got another job in advertising. A year and a half after starting to work at Deutsch as an assistant media planner, I was fired. I wasn't good at my job. I wasn't passionate about the work I was doing, and it showed. And I went to my brother's office crying from being fired. We always wanted to start a business together. He's an entrepreneur. He said, go home, bake your cupcakes. We'll start a business together. So I baked all these cupcakes and I sent them into work the next day with my best friend's little sister, who was staying with me for the summer. She was interning at Allison Broad PR. Allison was like a celebrity to me, a female who started her own business. And sure enough, like an hour after she gets to work, I'm getting all of these texts. Like, oh my God, everyone's obsessed with your cupcakes. Allison Broad ate two. Carly said that Allison wanted to put me in touch with her caterer. Sure enough, I get a call from her caterer later that day. He wants to bring me in for a tasting. Like, what? This was the day after I was fired from my job. And so I went and he tried every flavor and he said, wow, these are amazing. From a catering perspective, people love just to bite. If you could figure that out, oh my God. Like, okay, I have the chance to do what I love every day. I will stop at nothing to figure this out. And I found a very temporary solution to make the cupcakes just a bite. And I, I brought them back. Oh my God, these are amazing. I'm doing an event in Soho next week. Wear all black and bring me 250 cupcakes. And that was the first time I stood behind these bite-sized cupcakes as Melissa of Baked by Melissa. So when I was at the event, I put these business cards in front of the cupcakes and they took a card and that's how I started getting business. It's not easy to start your own business. And, you know, I was very fortunate to have people who love me and support me and have skills that I didn't on my team. Seven months after I started baking out of my apartment, my dad drove into the city and helped me move all of my ingredients and supplies from my little Murray Hill apartment kitchen to this big kitchen in Soho. We hired our first employee or person to help me bake. In True Baked by Melissa Fashion, we decided to open a bite-sized, if you will, pickup window that was attached to Cafe Barry. Now we have over 250 employees. It's really freaking cool. It's crazy. We have 14 retail locations. We have a growing e-commerce business. Dad used to tell me, what makes metal steel, baby? Extreme heat, because like, you gotta take the heat and it makes you strong and it made me stronger. There are always tough days. There, I've had my fair share, 100%. You need to have those really terrible days to appreciate the good ones. This photo was taken in my cubicle at Deutsch Advertising. If I could give her advice, it would be you can do anything. So you have to be confident in yourself.